first things first. If you're going to the military, you better know you want to do this. Because if you join here, it's too late. Like, like if if you if you're not sure, if you at home, you chilling, especially after high school. That's when I thought was me. After high school, man, you, you bored as hell. You don't know how to get out of the house. Like, man, I'm gonna sign the military. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's a good platform, but like it's a job where you better know you want to do this or not. Because if you don't, it's too late. And you'd be already in. But as far as like a good platform, I think the military is a good option, honestly. Especially if you don't know what to do or you're trying to go to college and you're just stuck at home. I think I think it is a good platform, but you better know you want to do this before you sign that contract and uh, all that stuff. But crazy stuff be happy, but you gotta let it slide. Like civilian world, you just like, you just let it, uh, like, you, you can do something about it here. You just gotta let it slide sometimes. You just don't care. People, people talk shit, people talk shit is what it is. What it is. Um, if you just graduated tech school or you just graduated boot camp, or you graduated boot camp, uh, welcome, congratulations. Uh, it ain't gonna be that hard. Just focus, don't get in trouble. Go to test school without getting in trouble at all. Because that sucks if you do. And we graduate test school and you come in right now, um, I'll probably see you. Simple as that. And test school is definitely different from, uh, Operational, like I know they always like say like crazy stuff like all oh, uh, this. I mean, don't get me wrong, like it's still serious, but like it's not the same. Like they treat you like an actual adult. Like test school is like you like a child still, like you like a child, but operation is like a, you're like an adult because you just make your own decisions. Like you make you your your appointments, you have to go to appointments. Like you have to go or you're done. Like you done. Okay. Um, hi, right, bro. So, how you feel about the Air Force in general? I feel like your mom is kind of bad. <laughs> What's the thing going on YouTube? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so how you feel about the Air Force in, uh, in general? How y'all feel about the Air Force? Uh, I just want glasses, bro. Oh, you want glasses? Yeah. These are unbreakable. All right, great. So, how do you feel about the Air Force, bro? Hmm? How about the Air Force, Force this year? Turn the camera on. Oh, it can't even tell because okay, here we go. Yeah, so this is we're in Minot, North Dakota, right now. We get stationed here. I ain't gonna lie, everybody been like, Oh, it's not that bad, not that bad. They fucking lying to you. It's bad, okay? It's cold as hell. Like yeah, we get we get new gear though. Mm -hmm. We get new, we get new gear, but it's 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 all right, it's pretty boring here. I mean, as long as you got friends, you chilling, you chilling. As long as you got a friend of me, or uh, I got a friend of you. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> the Air Force, if you don't like to take, uh, like, orders from people, like, if you don't like to, uh, like, if you, feel like, if you feel like you have to be in control the whole time, like, the Air Force is definitely not for you because they'll, you're definitely not the boss here, okay? I'm telling you that right now. You work for the government. They the boss, and you the pawn, okay? Just letting you know that. I definitely recommend the Air Force, though, for sure. Not any other branch. I mean, you can join any other branch, but don't get me wrong. But the Air Force, definitely. Yeah, another important piece of advice. Uh, if you're in a relationship, like, if you're not married outside of the military, do not join the military if you have a girlfriend. Or if, you have, if you're joining the military, do not be in a relationship, like, have a girlfriend boyfriend back at home okay it is not the smartest decision i'm telling you that right now it is not a good decision i would say what's going to be going on here but <laughs> all i can tell you is not being in a relationship outside of the military or back at home like if you had a relationship i mean if you kept them going and long but y'all gonna get married here go for it oh also do not get married in uh do not get married in test school I don't know why people do that. It's like, it makes you like, so if you get married in test school, your orders change and it makes you stay in like test school for a very long time. Like I, remember, I know one dude, like our, our test school three months. Bro been here for like seven months. Like that's crazy. Like bro been in test school for almost a year. Like 
That's wild. I can't imagine that shit. But, um. <clears throat> oh, yeah. You probably explaining why I'm going to reach for the box because I just took a shower and I got hungry. Okay. Uh, another thing about the Air Force do not come in here. Like, if you're from, like, the hood, I completely understand. Okay. Like, I get you from fucking. I knew you from Chicago or you was from Fort Lauderdale. Okay, we get it, all right? But once you join this military, you is not fighting nobody, okay? That's just how that's just you are, bro. Like, people gonna act hard here because they know they, they're not gonna get their ass beat. Like, that's that's just how it is. Like, it's not like back in the day where like you, get, you beat somebody's ass and like you just do push-ups the next day. Like, you do push-ups until you die. Here now, now like that's back then, but now it's like if you fight here, like you, you got jail time, like dead ass. You dead got jail time, and you getting discharged. So yeah, people here not gonna fight. They just gonna talk a lot of shit. Um, I don't recommend telling them anything because it makes a big deal about stuff. I just ignore it. You gotta ignore it. They don't really care to either. I mean, I feel like I summed everything up about my experience here. Um, have any questions, any comments, you know, just, just let me know in the description. Well, in the comments, in the comments. Let me know in the comments if you got any questions. And then I'll probably make a part two of this video and I'll let you know, like, what's up. But y'all let me know what y'all want to see in this in this YouTube channel. I got I got a lot of ideas, but while, while I'm stationed right now, like, this barely any shit to do. Like, barely anything. Like, there's barely anything to do. Like, I'm gonna try. I got, I, I got a lot of ideas, but, like... <clears throat> But definitely minimum, but I got y'all for real. Uh, this is gonna be the end of the video, y'all. Um, I appreciate y'all watching this video. I hope y'all watch the whole thing. Um, y'all sh make sure y'all share this video to whoever. If y'all got friends going to the Air Force, you know what I'm saying? Send them this because this is gonna be helpful for real. Oh, God. Uh, deuces.